All right, I'm kind of into this right now, so I'm going to just do this one last video before I geek out altogether. Um, and what I'm dealing with is this uh, TI Inspire CX. So maybe you're sitting there going, Charlie, I don't have a CX, I have a CAS. Go um, get one of your buddies or go online to TI Free uh, Upgrade, and your CAS will do this. You just need to have the 3.0 version. 3.0 so if you have 1.4 or 2.0 or whatever it is it's a free up, uh, upgrade what you don't get that the cast does give you is you don't get color and you don't get a, a backlit screen but other than that you get this functionality so let's uh, try this if you don't mind so I'm at graph here what I want you to do is go to your menu button and this is the button you press but if you press that button you'd see this so I'm gonna go to view I'm going to choose 3D graphing, and we know that we're, this is where we are. And then I just want you to try a couple of things. This is actually, I'm kind of kind of liking this. So I'm just going to type in, I don't know, um, sine, sine x, maybe cosine x. So cosine x, cosine, sorry, cosine x here. And if you're still with me, it's going to, no, I don't want it by x, cosine why, if you're still with me, it's going to pay off you in just a second because look what happens, what you get. That's absolutely the coolest thing in the whole world. And you're like, well, well, yeah, that is the coolest thing in the whole world. Well, I'm just kidding. It's not the coolest thing in the whole world because the coolest thing in the whole world, go back to your menu screen, and if you touch menu, you'll see this. And I'm going to go to actions, and actions just go to rotate, and from rotate, right from your calculator, just press the right cursor. Check that out. It's absolutely nuts. And if I touch it this way, yeah, and it's really really just amazing I'm just really think this is the coolest thing in the whole world so okay just to say that you can add to that so you can go to add to that and I think what I'm gonna add to that is something some weird function like you know X and then I'm gonna raise X to a power and to and when I have a, a, a rational exponent so I'm gonna do control division and that gives you that fraction but I'm gonna put it to the two thirds power right and use my right cursor to make sure I'm all the way over there and then I'm going to have that times, I don't know, sine of y, maybe sine, sine of y. And then hit enter. I mean, that is just amazing. It's so cool. Um, I'm going to go back to menu. Remember, the menu screen thing is here. When you press menu, you'll see this. Actions, rotate. This thing is just enormously cool. Um, let's see if I can get to that. Turn it like this. And what's also cool is that if you look over in the right hand, uh, top right hand side of the screen, it gives you an orientation to tell you which direction you're looking at this from. And I want to look at it like this. And that is just amazingly cool. What are you going to do with it? I, mean, I don't know yet. Uh, one thing I would do with it is just to have it said while we're here, I mean, let's talk about this. If you go to like screen capture, here's your screen capture button. If you screen capture this, right, capture the page. You can go back and look at that page, and the pages are here. So you just go to your menu and do that, but right here. Um, and then what you can do here is this. Double click on this. Let me go to my computer screen. You can copy and paste this. Where would you copy and paste it? You could copy and paste this. if you. Let's say you have a... Uh, a Microsoft Word document open right now. You could copy and paste it, and you could copy. One thing is when you copy and paste it, you can't change the orientation once it's on the page. But you could look at different orientations of this thing, um, put it on your Microsoft uh, in your Microsoft document, and then do that text wrap. And I mean that would be a really really impressive thing to uh, to provide to uh, to your professor. So, okay, I, I'm rambling. I know I'm rambling because I'm just geeked out right now. I apologize. Okay, this is a cool thing, and I hope you're having fun with it. Uh, look, do me a favor. If, you, if you're messing with this and you're like, you know what I can do, let me know. Could you please? It would be, it would be cool.